Happy Saturday, everyone. It's Mark Homan from Paul's Photo, the Lab at Paul's Photo, and the Creative Photo Academy. It's day 205 of our Be Creative series. And I'm really excited this weekend because we started the black and white workshop Friday night, and Tuesday and Wednesday we start boot camp. And I love to inspire you to bring new students in and get them all jazzed up about photography. And that's what the Be Creative series is all about. So I was in the kitchen tonight, my wife was cooking, and she was using garlic. And I love the shape and texture of the garlic. Come take a look. So what did I do? I threw three big cloves of garlic here on a cutting board. I've got the 12 by 12 Savage Light lighting here. I have a white piece of cardboard, just a white piece of cardboard. Yep, some Johnny Walker behind it. But what does the white piece of cardboard do? Brings the light in. So I've got the 12 by 12 soft light illuminating. The, the cardboard lighting, bringing the light back in so that the shadows are not so dark because I wanted the shadows to be a little bit muted. Now, what do you have to do when you use a piece of cardboard as a fill reflector like that? Make sure it's not in the picture and get it as close as you can to the subject. So it's just barely out of the picture. I have the 70 to 200 millimeter lens at about 150 millimeters. I have two ProMaster extension tubes on because the, the minimum focus on a 70 to 200 is four and a half or five feet and I'm at about three feet away. I need to get a little bit closer. So, aperture priority, F22. I need a, a, a very narrow aperture for a wide focus on this shot. So F22, aperture priority, ISO 400, gives me a shutter speed of about a 30th or a 15th of a second. So it's a very long exposure, so I'm going to use the touch shoot here on the Nikon Z7 and get it to fire. And it's going to be an awesome picture. You want to see it? There it is. It's so cool, right? It's going to be an awesome black and white when I'm done with it because I'm going to get all that texture and form in the garlic. I can't wait to share it with you. Look for it online so you're seeing this on either Facebook or Instagram or or um, uh, 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 or YouTube enjoy it gang share your pictures I can't wait to see what you're doing and let's see how creative you can be use the hashtags hashtag Paul's photo hashtag creative photo Academy and hashtag we're all together our social media family is growing for those of you who are watching the videos and posting your pictures I look at them every day thanks for taking the pictures thanks for posting them thanks for being part of the community Tomorrow's another day, another chance to be creative, and I can't wait to share it with you. Mark Komen from Paul's Photo, the Lab at Paul's Photo and Creative Photo Academy, wishing you great pictures and happy Saturday night.